22 sure signs that your relationship is going to the next level. Number 22. You never run out of things to talk about. Everyone will agree that love is the most potent emotion someone can feel. People pick their lovers carefully because they want to give their heart to the right one. Before getting into a relationship, we start off by getting to know each other and figuring out who you're compatible with and deciding if that person is your ultimate partner. But what matters most is if the feeling is mutual between both people. And usually, this is fairly easy to know. Everyone can sense if someone doesn't feel the same towards them or if feelings aren't reciprocated. For some couples, a sure sign that the relationship isn't going to work is if you both find yourselves running out of things to talk about and the silence gets awkward. But if the relationship is going well and the connection is real, you never run out of things to say because conversation just flows effortlessly. Number 21. You'll share inside jokes. Over the years or even months that you've known each other, without even trying, the two of you will have created such a comfort level that it's almost natural to have inside jokes with each other. All the funny incidents and clumsy moments that happen are the roots for the inside jokes. If you are thinking about them only after meeting a few times, you are entirely ready to take it up to the next level. Number 20. The F word doesn't really bother you anymore. No, I'm not talking about the word you're thinking of, but something more serious. Family. Getting someone to meet your family makes most people anxious, but if you're seriously contemplating it, then you're most likely ready for the next level. Or maybe you have already met your partner's family and you get along great with them. If your partner gets along well with your family and they accept them and love them just like you do, then that is a great sign it's going to last. Number 19. Their friends are excited to meet you. If your partner's friends are excited to meet you, then that means they probably talk about you a lot. That's always a good sign if they brag about you to their friends and talk about you all the time. This is a sure sign that they are all about you and focused on you. This means they are interested in the next move. And even better if your friends and your new love get along with each other. Number 18. You use we a lot. Saying things like we should go to the movies together or we should go on a trip sometime are all good signs that you want to move to the next level and you see that person in your future. Using we testifies both of you as being tight with each other. If a lot of activities and plans include both of you, it's a clear signal to take it up a notch. Number 17. She often modifies your appearance. Maybe it's something as simple as buying a new shirt or coming along with you for a haircut, but she definitely gives her opinions on things about you. It means you should look the part when you are with your partner. It's not good to change yourself for the person you're dating, but if they are showing you what they like and don't like and giving their opinion about things on your looks, stepping your game up on your looks is only going to make them more attracted to you. So it can't hurt to keep up with the upkeep of your appearance. Number 16, they have belongings at your place. They might come over to your place so often that they are bound to leave some essential items there, like a toothbrush or a few pairs of clothes. If this is happening, it means you two are comfortable with each other and are with each other often enough that it would be silly not to have a few things left at one of your houses. If they have a designated drawer at your home, this is a great sign the relationship is moving on to the next level in no time. Number 15, you comfort each other. When you're upset about something, you want to talk about it with your special person and vice versa. Both of you are emotionally connected that you'll depend on each other for support whether it be good or bad. This is healthy in all relationships. It's always a good sign if your partner comes to you when they've had a bad day, or calls you when they get off work on their way home when they're frustrated. This means they feel comfort and support within you. Number 14, agree to disagree. No matter how perfect a relationship is, some disagreement is bound to happen at some point. But what's important is that the spark that lights up your world doesn't go off. Of course you're allowed to not be on the same page and still be in love with each other. Arguments are going to happen sometimes, and this is completely normal. You'll always be learning about one another and figuring out how to deal with that person. As long as the feelings stay strong on both ends, you'll be totally fine. Number 13. You think their quirks are adorable. When you're with someone who has an annoying habit, something that you could live without, but when they are away, that is one of the one things you miss about them when they're not around. This is a sign that you're into the person so much that you're willing to put the silly and nerdy things aside just to love and accept it. Quirks are things that make us different from other people. And if the person is really in love with you, they'll find your quirks to be one of the cutest things about you. Number 12. You show them off on social media. Most of us today use Instagram as a place to share and store our best photos of whatever you're into that day. And if your new love is in the picture, well, that's a good sign. If your partner is posting photos of you or the both of you together to show off to their friends and putting it out there for the world to see, this means they are not ashamed of you and want to show you off to everyone. It shows that they don't care that other people know that they are taken. This doesn't mean that if you post your boyfriend or girlfriend that everything you do is about them or your relationship. But let's be real, Instagram is for bragging. People show off their best looks and their best photos on Instagram. This is so true that it should be in the terms of use. Number 11. You trust each other. 
Being able to fully trust your partner is key and one of the most important things to a lasting relationship. If you and your partner are both totally confident and have each other's backs, then that's a very important signal that you're ready to take the next step as a couple. This goes for things like when you both tell each other something in confidence, neither of you shares the information with anyone, even your best friend. It's difficult to be vulnerable and share problems with other people. So when your partner opens up to you, it's really important you don't break their trust. Number 10, you support each other. There's nothing more comforting than knowing you're with someone who supports you in all your good times and your bad. If you think of your partner as your rock, that is a super positive sign for the future. Asking your significant other how they're doing without even sharing your own issues or problems for the day allows you to be totally available to them. Listening to your lover's problems and lending an ear to them is a great way to get out of your own head and let your partner know that you are present to listen to them, and they'll really appreciate that. Number nine, you both take accountability. One of the biggest red flags in a relationship is a partner that never admits when they're wrong and refuses to take accountability for their actions. If you or your significant other do or say something wrong, apologize before it escalates. If one of you are upset with the other, talk it out without getting defensive. Realize and acknowledge what your part was and talk about what you could do differently in the future. This could save you from a lot of arguments and possibly save your relationship. If you're both able to do these things, then you can confidently take the next step in your relationship. Number eight, satisfied with the level of intimacy. You can work through intimacy issues with your partner, but you shouldn't move forward in a relationship if you're not happy with the current level of intimacy, whether that means in the bedroom or outside of it, because it won't magically get better just because you move in together or get engaged. A good sign is if you physically touch each other, whether it's just a kiss, snuggling on the couch, or holding hands. Even non-sexual touching helps build a connection between people. Number seven, you're both independent. In any relationship, it's important that both partners need to have a level of independence and a life apart from their partner, even if it's just a hobby or activity they like to do on their own. In a healthy relationship, you can do your own thing without overstressing. You should be able to do independent activities with friends and making sure you take care of yourself and your own commitments without stressing or yearning to be with your lover. Some time apart is always healthy. Always remember not to forget about yourself in a relationship. Number six, you talk about money. Money is a sensitive subject for many of us, but talking to your partner about finances is key to taking your relationship to the next step and intertwine your lives and your bank accounts, if you're ready for that. If you're ready for that, you're ready for the next step when you both share similar financial communication and there is a clear understanding between both of you and who will pay for what. Number five, you feel safe in the relationship. Sometimes knowing you're ready for the next stage in a relationship is just a feeling you have and you might not even be able to explain it. When you start feeling really safe with the person you're with, like you can fully be yourself and they still love and accept you. It's usually a sign that both of you are ready to take the next step. No matter if you've been dating for a few weeks or a few years, there's always room to grow. If you have felt like you want something more out of a relationship, don't be afraid to voice it and talk to your partner about taking the next step forward together. Number four, you share similar values. In the early stages of a relationship, it's easy to get distracted by the fun and excitement. But in order to move forward into a more serious relationship, it's crucial to find out whether or not your values line up with your partners when it comes to the important stuff. If you do have similar priorities in life, then consider taking the next step. By discussing things like if you don't want kids or you don't want to get married, it decreases any misunderstandings for your future together. Number three, not stressed about your morning look. If you aren't stressed anymore about what you look like when you wake up in the morning or about having food in your teeth or being intimate without being shaved, because you know that they think you're attractive no matter what at this point. This shows you're comfortable with each other and don't expect your partner to be perfect all the time. Number two, you are yourself around them. When we meet someone new, we're presenting a version of ourselves that is carefully acted out. Most of us don't show off our authentic selves the first time we meet someone. We usually open up later once we feel more comfortable and figure out our comfort level. But when we let go and show off who we really are, it's because we trust the person in front of us and aren't afraid of scaring anyone away. We realize that if people don't like or accept you for your authentic self, then you don't need that person in your life. If the person you're dating fits most of these signs and loves you for you no matter how silly or weird you might be, then what are you waiting for? Break up with a single life and upgrade your relationship status to take in. It might be scary, but the reward will definitely outweigh the risk. Number one, your significant other praises you more than anyone else. It's easy to take people for granted, especially the people you see every day. But we all do things and we deserve appreciation and praise even from someone we see all the time. The right person will see the good in you over and over again. And the right person for you also always appreciates you. Not only will that make you feel good, but it can help you be a better person because sometimes being appreciated is the main reason we keep trying to better ourselves and grow as a person.
Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.